Hey guys, what is up? How are you doing? It is your girl Tiffany. So I am here to do a grocery haul. If you're new, I would love for you to subscribe. I do a lot of different hauls and vlogs and videos and organizing and just about everything you can think of. I do grocery hauls from time to time. I'm not going to say I always do grocery hauls. I, I have to be in the mood to do a grocery haul. I'm currently in the mood because I'm bored and I don't know what else to do and we went grocery shopping today. So I thought I would share for, with you what we got from the grocery store. Um, yeah, and we went to Dollar Tree too. And I'm sweating like, I'm just sweating so bad y'all. So I don't know if I mentioned this, but our air conditioner went out Saturday night. I just noticed nothing was at work going. Nothing was happening when I turned on the AC. And so I got my fan here. Can you see my fan? Yeah, my little old fan. So I got all the fans going. Well, I bought some box fans and they don't help that much. I still woke up sweating. Um, I thought I was going to rough it out because my brother, that's actually what he does for a living. He lives in Arizona and he fixes air conditioners and he, you know, he does pretty good there. I mean, living in Arizona, that, doing that kind of job because if you know, it's really hot in Arizona. Um, so anyway, I thought he was going to come visit this month so I was just gonna wait and I was planning oh I'll just wait until my brother comes and just live on fans but that's not really cutting it for me I'm just so sweaty and it's just the fans aren't doing enough so I've called the air conditioner guy hopefully he's coming tomorrow well he is hopefully he is they said he is but I hope it can get fixed so crossing my fingers um Yes, so I do apologize for the fan noise, but that's that's just what's going on. And I've been glad that we've been out most of the day because the air conditioning in Walmart is so good. And yeah, so that is what's going on. So I'm gonna get into this haul, show you what I picked up from Walmart, Dollar Tree, and that's it. Let's get into it. I'm gonna start out with Dollar Tree this time. I usually do Walmart first, but Dollar Tree was way easier to put out. So let's do Dollar Tree first. So I did pick up some canned food. Um, this is Purina dog chow. I do start have started giving mix and wet food with the dry food for my dogs. So I've got two cans of that. Um, this one is with real beef. Oh, they're both, they're both with real beef. And then I like to give them some treats. So I've got sausage links. This is pork chop. Um, Abigail picked up this Sunny Delight. I was looking for cranberry juice. Now this is diet cranberry juice. Um, I've never tried diet, but uh, we'll see how that goes. We'll see if it's any good. And then we got some cinnamon applesauce for Abigail. We got two six pa two six packs of water, and we you will see that we got water from Walmart too. But I like the bottled water. Like I like to keep a water by my bed at night because it's just so hot, and I just like having water right by me, right by my bed. So, and then my husband picked up this lavender odor thing for the room for his office so that'll be nice he we also picked up this wrist support we got this wrist support um for his hand because he cuts a lot of brisket at work and he hurt his hand so he has to wear that and then we picked up this nutella very good so we did get something from dollar tree plus abigail got this to-do list and it was five bucks because she's my husband noticed we noticed she was making a to-do list like I don't know. Where did you get the to-do list idea? From you. Oh. oh. I just realized you're in your underwear. I'm going to have to cut that part out. Oh, my God. Okay, so to-do list. Yeah, she got a to-do list. <sighs> okay, yeah, $5. <sighs> okay. And then we got some white rice, long grain white rice. I picked up this Ajax um, dish soap. And then I picked up some body wash, this tropical scented. I've used this before, it's pretty good. And then I picked up some cotton candy. And we did get a few more things, but they don't want me to show it. I'm so I'm gonna go to Walmart now. We got three pounds of ground beef. We got our wheat bread. We always get wheat bread. I got some hamburger buns. Uh, we're having hamburgers tonight. And I used to get great value buns and hot dog buns. But I stopped because they really do fall apart pretty quickly, the Great Value ones. And Penelope was complaining about it. And this one is Pepperidge Farm um, hot dog buns. So, did get different kind of buns, if you know what I mean. Then I got some tortillas. We're going to have tacos this week. 
I got some Valesic kosher dill pickles. Um, got some soy sauce flavored ramen noodles. We really like those. I got some bananas. I've uh, got some buttermilk ranch for my salad. Now this is new for us. We got this Smucker's Goober grape and we were gonna buy just a separate grape jelly and peanut butter and then Penelope was like, Mom, this kind of goes together. So let me know if you tried that. We're gonna have that. We got Manwich Bowls. We've got a twin pack of Hamburger Helper that is four cheese lasagna. We got Great Value Spaghetti Noodles. We got the Classico Four Cheese Spaghetti Sauce. We've got a ta Mild Taco Bell Seasoning Mix for our tacos. We've got the 12 pack of Mini Nilla Wafers. Um, yeah, for the kids. One more week of summer here for us. We got the Great Value um, Cinnamon Rolls. Um, and Penelope actually prefers Great Value Cinnamon Rolls over Pillsbury and all that. We picked up Kraft Singles Cheese, American Cheese. Um, yeah, I use this for grilled sandwich, grilled cheese sandwiches. Um, and then we got Cheddar Jack Shredded Mild and Monterey Jack Cheese. Got my romaine salad that I always get. And I always, if y'all watch my holes of grocery hauls before, I, these are like things I always get. And then bell peppers. Um, and then we got a two liter Coke. Yeah, two liter Coke. A few more stuff from um, Walmart. Um, I actually got three of these Crystal Geyser waters because we so badly needed water. We're drowning over here. Um, and then we got some milk, 2% milk. I got some pineapple chunks. We definitely needed more fruit. We got some red grapes. I got this for Abigail. I, I put it, we went shopping this morning and I put it, it's already frozen. And it was only 25 cents at Walmart, this icy slush. And I thought, I, I should have picked up more than one, but um, I got the Capri Sun for the girls and got some weenies. I got some Daisy sour cream for the tacos. I got two Tony's pizza for the girls. Cheesy Ranch Chicken Pasta. That is really good. That is a winner in our house. Got some Angel Soft Toilet Paper. Got some Paper Towels. These are 50 cents each. And then I got this adjustable two-tier rolling garment rack. I've actually had one of these before. I think I might have sold it. But I got this from Walmart. And I think it's, did I say it was 15 bucks? Yeah, I specifically got this for a garage sale that I'm having. So, yeah, because I had nowhere to, like, hang the clothes. And I know my floor's dirty, sorry. But, yeah, that's what I got. I also wanted to show you guys a clip. My daughter, Abigail, who is seven, she loves horses. She loves country stuff. And my husband bought her a guitar from Walmart toy section. And she really loves it. So, I'm going to insert some clips here of her playing it and she told me to record her so I didn't force her or anything like that. It kind of got twisted a little. Mm-hmm. Got to turn around. Let me see, what does it say? Wait. First act musician. You really like it? Do you want to learn how to play the guitar? No, I know, I already know. Mm -hmm. Did you say you were gonna go? You're not. You were gonna go by Gail instead of Abigail. Yeah. Um, that'll be a name for me. That's gonna be a nickname. Yeah, Gail. Gail with a guitar. Gail with a guitar. I love it. It's really pretty. Mhm. Mm it was in a big box. Yeah. Real big. I couldn't even hold it. So did you wanted it asked or Joseph offer or what happened? Joseph's like, here. Yeah, I know you've been wanting a guitar. He knew you'd been wanting one. Song up. Uh, what are you saying sorry about? I'm 
sorry. <laughs> That's that Patsy Cline song, I think. No, so, she said, I'm so sorry. It's a Cubby and Friday song. Okay, guys. Okay. Bye. Can I play like effects from the background? Yeah. <laughs> She's got like so sweat guys, on I'm her gonna face. I keep forgetting stuff in the song, and it could be all the like stuff, like okay. where I'm born and stuff about me. Okay. Let's see. Where are you born? I was born in the state. Wait, what is the state again? I forgot the state. <laughs> Let me try again. I was born in the city. Wait, I see. I was supposed to say state. Huh? Man, yeah. this time I forgot the state. Well, let's try again. Well, well let's say the state again. I was born in the state. Where was the state? Boo. Do you never say the state? Is this just supposed to be a funny thing? Yeah. Uh. Well, um, there's something that my mom and I have, and our family basically, well, we haven't mentioned anything on YouTube, but I'm a really good at guitar. And so, here, let me play something for you. <laughs> Is that how you play the guitar? That's not how you play guitar. <laughs> Give me like a tablet. Let me show you how you play. Show it to us. Show us how it's done. Her <laughs> <laughs> face is all sweaty. <laughs> hey guys, what is up? Um, so today is Tuesday. I think it's Tuesday. So we finally got our air conditioner fixed, which was really nice. Um, but I turned it off for right now so I can do this part of the video. But yeah, if you've reached this part of the video, I'm going to be showing you what I picked up at a garage sale this past weekend. And I also went thrifting. I went to the Goodwill. So if you know me and know my channel, you know I love to thrift. So I just thought I would share what I found because I just love it. I'm on my knees. It is close to bedtime. Y'all, I have had a wild day. That's all I can say. A very wild dead day. Okay, first I'm going to show you what I picked up at a garage sale. So, really cute stuff. Okay. So, first of all, I got this little bucket list booklet. Um, and it's really cool because um, you write down what your bucket list is. Something that you want to do. And then you write the story about it. I thought it was just really neat. So, I got this for 50 cents. And I just thought it was really unique. And then I also picked up the, um, this little polar bear. How cute is he, y'all? I love polar bears. If you've been watching my channel, you know I love Coca-Cola. And I just love polar bears. He was 50 cents. And then another thing I picked up was, speaking of Coca-Cola, I picked up um, this little decor, this lady kind of vintage Victorian-like lady. It says Pepsi Cola. I really, really like that. They had a few different ones, but I liked the looks of this lady, so I picked that up. You can kind of see, like, my kind of style. And then, oh my gosh, I kind of regret turning off the AC already. And then, oh, the tag came off of here. And then I got this bird for 50 cents, and it's really pretty. Um, it's very, like, got a lot of good detail on it. I really like it because it looks like vintage, Victorian, and I don't know, ever since my mom passed away, um, I don't know what it is, but I notice birds more. I just notice nature in general. So, yeah, I don't know. I just thought this bird was really pretty. So, and I'm also kind of picky about what I'm getting. Like, I don't want to get just a bunch of crap. I want to get like pieces that I think are really unique and cool because as I've said, I am going to be redoing my room in the future. Okay, now let's go to Goodwill. Goodwill had some great stuff. I went today and the other day. So I got this little frame and it says Paris is always a good idea. Oop, wrong little thing. So that is this and it's, um, it says it was $5.00 wherever they got it from but I got it for three dollars at Goodwill and it's it's I mean it's brand new so I think Penelope may put this in her room I love that it's very cute and then I picked up this booklet and it says blessings for the morning prayerful encouragement to begin your day and I like that it has just like um, little verses and stuff like that 
just really good things to lift you up while you're drinking your coffee. The kids are about to start back to school, so maybe I'll be making more time for myself. We'll see. Okay. What is this? I think this was for Abigail. Okay, I picked this up for little Abigail. Penelope doesn't like to thrift. My 12-year-old, she thinks thrifting is... It's not her thing, but Abigail's really into it. And this, I picked picked her up this thing, and it's like kind of like a romper, and but it's like longer in the back and then shorter in the front. So it's very cute. It just looks like an Abigail kind of thing, and she loved it. Two things me and Abigail have in common: we love dogs and we love to thrift. And then, I always look at the clothes at Goodwill. I picked up this pink shirt. It's just a basic tee. It's like burgundy. Can you see the pink? Yep. So, it's just like a basic tee. I might have to go to the gym a little bit more to fit into it. <laughs> I don't know. And then, I picked up this shirt. I'm not sure if this could be like a night shirt or it could be... um or it could be like something you wear on a date or for business. It's an apartment nine shirt. It's in a large. It's silky. See what I mean? It looks like it could be night wear. <laughs> it also could be like a sexy shirt. And like it ties up right there. It's in a large. Apartment nine is from Kohl's. And then next I got these pants. I mean, they're not pants. They're shorts. Honestly, I don't know if these are for teenagers or for my size. They probably are too small for me. I, let's see. It, sa it just says oh, they're a large. That's all it says. It doesn't have a brand name on it. But, I don't know. They just look like some nice shorts. So, I don't know if those will fit me. Or they may fit Penelope. <laughs> so, I do not know. Um... Once again, I saw really cute stuff for Abigail. She is my little Western girl. She loves to play the guitar, as you've seen in this video. She loves horses. And I got her this um, suede dress from Goodwill. It's so soft. I believe that's suede. What does it say? It's called Paper Queen. It has polyester, 8% spandex, made in Egypt. And it was $5.99. And it's got zippers on each side, so super cute. Oh my god, I'm burning up in this house. Not a smart idea to turn off the air already. Okay. And then I got Abigail this dress. I thought it was just so cute. She could wear it this fall or wear it to school. Also from the Goodwill. How cute is this dress? $5.99. It's just so cute. Okay, and then I always check out the dresses too. Uh, this next dress I'm going to show you. I don't have it here. It's already in the dirty laundry. And I actually wore it the same day I got it. I know most people wash dresses from Goodwill before they wear it. <laughs> just, I just wore it. So I'm going to insert a picture of it now. Okay, and the next thing I got, <laughs> I'm hot and I'm sweaty. Okay, another dress I got was this one. This is for me. It looks kind of small, but it is a large and it is pretty stretchable and it's got pretty flowers on it. So I really liked that. And then another thing I got was this shirt and it's a long sleeve, but it has like shoulder cutouts i really like that and even though it is long sleeve it's like very airy so it's not like real thick so it'd probably be good for like a summer day not summer i mean like a spring day and this is no boundaries so i know this is like the walmart brand um this is sold at walmart and the lady at the checkout really liked it too and speaking of walmart we went on tax-free day what was it, tax free weekend this past weekend? Penelope bought a bunch of clothes, or my husband bought a bunch of clothes for Penelope. 
but I can't show them because she's a teenager and she don't want me showing her stuff. So I have to show respect, but he did get me a couple of things too. And I picked out two long sleeve, like thermal, what, what does it say here? Yeah, thermal long sleeve shirts for fall. And I picked out this one in mustard yellow, time and true, $7.98. Really like that. And once again, you can tell one of my favorite colors is burgundy. And I got this one, time and true, for the fall. And I really, really love it. Okay, guys, I need to go turn on the AC. <laughs> Thank God for AC, really, y'all. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. I've had a heck of a night. There was some drama that went on, but it's gone now. It's good. I love my husband so much, and I don't know if he'll watch this, but thank y'all so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.